All right, so for some reason people don't like it when I share my opinions online. It's the fact that people think their opinions matter on the fucking internet. So discontent with your life that you're arguing with people you've never seen before online. Are you... are you fuck? Okay. So, obviously, since opinions don't matter, I recently came across a mathematical concept called the Golden Ratio, which basically dictates how attractive a certain object is, physically speaking. When you apply this concept to a human face, it's the length of the face divided by the width, and the closer it is to 1.62, the more attractive that person is. There are a lot more complexities to the formula, but this is the gist of it. And I've used an absolutely foolproof way of measuring League of Legends characters to give you the most accurate ranking of the mathematically most attractive champion. Now I'll be honest, I couldn't be bothered to measure all 150 plus champions, so I just did the ones that make it onto the S tier. Believe it or not, I don't have all day to spend sticking a ruler on my screen and stare at numbers, so keep that in mind. I thought this list was meant to be objective. This is the tier list. Well, you've never seen a tier list before. So number 9 will be Diana, and the conversation around putting her in S tier went a little something like this. S tier? Uh, I will put a very solid A on this. Mm. Yeah, um, um, yeah, S, S, S. S, sorry, we'll bring it up to yeah. S. And that's how all the S tiers ended up there. So next up is Aurelia at 1.292, which is 0.396 away from the golden ratio. Now this is a good time to remind you all that the golden ratio does not care if you have the biggest head in the universe, as long as the length of your head size is supported by the width to make 1.68 you are beautiful. Uh, you can see here changing the length to 1000 doesn't really change the ratio because the width is like 600 something to compensate. Ari. This one might be a bit of a shocker to some because, you know, website. Oh. Okay. Fucking just here. Can you? So, yeah, golden ratio looking a bit shaky. Next is Kaisa at 1.368, 0 0.25 off the golden ratio. I don't know what to say here. that's not a typo, Samira actually has the same ratio as Kaisa, which is a great example of different measurements, same ratio. Next is Evelyn at 1.375. Now guys, I think this is a great time to acknowledge that my measurement skills are questionable to say the least, so take these measurements with a grain of salt. Uh, I'm pretty sure the ratios are relatively close though. Next is Lux at 1.38. Now that we've hit Lux, let's address the elephant in the room. Which skins am I basing these measurements off of? Well, it's simple. If the skins are facing the front with as little tilt as possible, that's the one I'm going for. This is so that I could see the entire face to measure. Yeah, no, no deeper meaning. If uh, this video gets successful, I might do um, all the skins, all a thousand of them. It's Seraphine. Now that we've come to the end, can we get a drum roll, please? It's Cosmic Queen Ash with the ratio of 1.471. I settle down, settle down, it's not my choice. But in a way, it's kind of fitting, isn't it? Beauty really is subjective. Next time somebody calls you ugly, just know that you're about as pretty as a JPEG image in a MOBA game. I'm actually really disappointed that we didn't even get close to 1.682. I'm calling it early, someone like Malphite might have a closer measurement to the golden ratio. I'm not even kidding. Oh yeah, here's a visual that I totally didn't spend an hour on. Now I know what some people are thinking. Or you basement dwelling discord mod, why didn't you add guys you desperate f To that, I present you a single clip. I, I like her. She's got big, big. 
Oh yeah, just by the way, uh, as I'm recording this, some kids in Melbourne apparently got caught for putting their female classmates on like tier lists. So that's kind of messed up. Three year 11 boys behind a sickening spreadsheet ranking female classmates' appearance. Their photos put into categories ranging from wifeys and cuties to objects and unrapeable. Like, I know how ironic it seems coming from me since I just did a tier list on like beauty and attractiveness and whatnot, but that's like, that's real life, you know, that's like messed up. Don't, don't do that. <laughs>